Hello, if you want to set up the secure folder on Samsung Galaxy A25 5G, you can go to the settings. Then in the settings, you want to go to security and privacy. Scroll down a little bit to go to more security settings. And then over here, we can tap secure folder. Then press continue one more time. And now we need to wait for the device to set up the secure folder. This might take even a couple of minutes. So let's be patient with that. After that, we will need to set up a password for our secure folder. So let's press done. And now we can choose pin code, password or pattern. We can also enable or disable the fingerprint sensor. So you can unlock the secure folder with your fingerprint if you have it enabled, of course. And you can also reset the access to secure folder with your Samsung account if you want to. So that if you forget the password, you can recover the access. So I'm going to choose a simple pin code over here. Let's press continue one more time. And OK. Now we are asked if we want to turn on a reset with Samsung account. I'm going to cancel that and forget your luck. OK, let's go next. And we have the secure folder. So now if you want to add another app to the secure folder, you can press this plus button here. And you can choose one of the apps that you have installed on your device. So let's say I'm going to add Facebook over here and then we can press add. And there we go. We have Facebook added to the secure folder. We can also tap on these three dots on the right side in order to find different options that might be useful. For instance, the lock and exit one. And of course, if you want to uninstall the app, if you want to remove it actually from the secure folder, you want to press and hold your finger on the app and then you have the option to uninstall. Keep in mind that if you uninstall it from the secure folder, you don't un uninstall it from the device itself because these apps in secure folder work like in a separate environment. And these are like separate apps, including of course, every data that we have on these apps. So if you have some data outside of the secure folder, this data will not be included in this folder and vice versa. So you can use different accounts, different data and so on and so forth. And that's it pretty much. Now the secure folder will be found in the app drawer, for example. So you can access it over here. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.